Hey there, today we're going to explore the Final Cut Pro interface and explain what each button and section does in a simple way. We'll start with the basics to help you get started. In the top left corner, you'll find the library sidebar. You can show or hide it by clicking the clapper icon. Here you can see your libraries, events, and projects. The music icon takes you to photos and audio. The T icon shows titles and generators. To the right, we have the browser. It's where you can find the clips you've imported. Next to the browser, there's the viewer. This is where you can see a preview of the frame your playhead is on. At the bottom left of the viewer, you'll find the transform tools for adjusting your footage. To the right, there are tools for enhancing your video and audio. Over here, we have the retime tools for changing the speed of your clips. Down below, we have the timeline. This is where you arrange and edit your clips to make a complete video. Clicking on the index shows tools for organizing your timeline. And we can hide it by clicking on the index again, just like a magic trick. You can also pick different timeline tools by clicking on this arrow icon. On the right, you'll see the effects and transition menus. In the top right, there's the inspector. It has lots of options for customizing your clips. You can switch between these icons to control different clip settings. But before we go further, give us a thumbs up if you like what you're learning. It helps us know we're doing a good job and helps others find this video. Thanks. The first icon with a film strip is the video inspector, where you edit clip parameters like effects, position, rotation, and size. The second one with a triangle is the color inspector for color correction and grading. The third with a speaker is the audio inspector for audio adjustments like volume and audio effects. The last one with a small eye is the info inspector, which shows clip information like resolution, clip name, and more metadata. On the top right, you'll find five icons. The first icon with two monitors changes what is displayed on your second monitor and will only show up if you have a second display connected to your computer. The second with six squares shows and hides the browser. The third with a line and three squares does the same for the timeline. The fourth with three sliders toggles the inspector on and off. The last one is the share button for exporting your project. Now you know the Final Cut Pro interface, from top to bottom, left to right. And here's something special for you. We have an awesome pack of 99 titles, effects, and transitions made exclusively for Final Cut Pro. They'll make your videos look super professional. The best part, it's worth 138, but it's absolutely free for you. Just click the link in the description to get these amazing tools. Happy editing.